All right, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to this Gerald Johnson, my career. Now, yesterday, um, the reason why there wasn't a video is because I actually recorded Gerald Johnson, my career, but it once again, OBS failed me, and the video got messed up. But we went up against the Nuggets. Um, Jokic ended up balling out. I ended up dropping 51, and we won by 23. And by the way, probably what's probably going to be the thumbnail of this video is the fact that I dropped um 80 something points. I forgot was it again? Yep, I dropped 86 points near triple double against the Brooklyn Nets. This was a while, like weeks ago, on um, when I played this game, and of course OBS messed it up. But DeAndre Jordan, Kyrie, James Harden, and Kevin Durant all had over 22 points, and they still got spanked because I dropped 86. So that's what's probably most likely going to be the thumbnail of this video. So yeah, that was the game for January. We're now on the game for March. Which is the second to last game of the... S no, it's not. It's it's the third to last game of the season, right? Yeah, because it's still April and May. Anyways, we're going up against Warriors. We do have Klay Thompson, Steph Curry. We are currently 43-7. and seven. We're on a two-game losing streak. We're on a 21-game winning streak before this, so... Very interesting. We're definitely going to be the number one seed. Anyways, I'm going to hope that this actually, you know, goes smoothly record-wise, recording-wise, and we can get a win over the Warriors. Here we are in Cleveland for this classic matchup with the Warriors and the Cavs. Warriors are 30 and 19, and I think they were 8th in the West? Nah, they had to have been like 6th or something. There's no way you're 30 and 19 in our 8th. It is the Western Conference, but there's just no way. Anyways, here we are in Cleveland. We got the good old Warriors versus um, Cavs matchup. Um, the Cavs City Court apparently is not loading, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure if that's the mod I have probably. I probably have a Cavs Court mod. We got Steph Curry versus Gerald Johnson is the key matchup. I do have the Cavs court mod. Who cares? This city court is ugly anyway. So are the jerseys. I picked it just to pick it. Anyways, let's get it going. And James Wiseman wins a tip. Oh, Curry starting off already with the three. Ah, you, you love to see it. I'm going to run an ISO on Curry. He can, he's not really good. Great defender. I can't speak. Andre draw. Oh, what a layup by Gerald. Okay, then. By the way, yeah, if you look at, I already explained it in the intro, but the title of the video is has to do with my 86 point game against the Nets. Um, I wish I got that recorded, but once again, OBS doesn't like me apparently. So that game, sadly, will never be seen. Curry, this is this is going to be an interesting matchup. I did turn up the sliders, so basically everything for the CPU is on 63. Which, Hall of Fame is usually 55, as I'm going to miss that mid-range, but Andre Drummond is on the glass. Yeah, everything on um, Hall of Fame is usually on 55, and uh, a the user, I can't speak, is 45? 45 or 50. And, like, it just results in blowouts, so. I'm hoping we get a close game and we can actually win. As Clay Thompson with the post fade away, it's off. Larry Nance Jr. gets the board. I'm going to sling it out. To Colin Sexton, give it back to me in the... Oh, I, I, I got fouled. I mentioned this in the video I attempted to record for yesterday. Is that Gerald and Harold are both on one-year contracts. Uh, I'm not sure. They might be restricted since they're rookies. Um, but in real life, the Cavs are looking to trade Drummond. Now, the thing is, if Harold and Gerald return to the Cavs next season, which I don't know if they are or not, will Drummond be here? Honestly, he might not be here because he is on a one-year deal and... I'll just let the Cavs do whatever they want. If they end up resigning him, they do. Um, but if he's not here, then he's, he's just not here. So he is really good in 2K, obviously. So we'll just see how it is. But yeah, the Cavs want Jared Allen to start in real life. And I like Jared Allen's really good in this game. So if we do end up staying, I am fine with having Jared Allen as our starting center. Also, another thing I mentioned is that Kevin Love is on the bench, as you can see. He is awful starting. He averaged like 10 points on 40% shooting starting. And off the bench, he is averaging like 13 points on like near 50% shooting. And Larry Nance is just a lot more fun to play with in the starting lineup. He's also a better defender. Oh, that's Curry's second foul. I got an one, by the way. So Curry's going to have to sub out here. And we can take a 9-point lead very easily over this Warriors team. All right. Now I got a guard. Wiggins is there. Point. Okay. I got my takeover. And we're on the fast break. I'm going to stop and pop. Yeah, I knew once the, it was in the center of the shot meter, it wasn't going in. For some reason, 2K, if it's not, well, at least for this jump shot, if it's not green, 
and it's in the center, it's going to miss. It has to be a, a late release for it to go in, for, at least for the jump shot I have, which I believe is Trey Burke. I'm, oh, I got Wiggins on me. I mean, I got my takeover. Oh, I do not want to take that shot. Give it back to me. I got my takeover, and I'm just going to shoot it. That might go in. See, what I say, if it's late, it's going to go in. Oh, I'm on the fast break. Oh, yeah, Marquise Chris is not catching up to me. I did a layup instead of a dunk, but I got 14 points, 8 assists, and we're currently up by 15. Probably because the Warriors don't have a backup um, point guard. But the lineup they have right now, they're running clay at point guard, is pretty solid. But as I say that, Wiggins greens. But you know what? This is better. It would have been a 20 point game right now if um, I had the other sliders on. So that's good. Okay, I'm getting subbed out here. We are only up by 9. 35 seconds left in the first quarter. Okay, Larry Nance is at the line. That was weird. We're up by 7. I'm happy because this is a close game, actually. And there's only four minutes left in the second, so that's good. Oh, give me that steal! I'm on the break! Look at... Okay, that was great. I don't get those steals often at all. Because, you know, I'm not that good at the game. But when I get them, it, it is very nice. I, I have better dunk packages, too. I don't know why I always do crappy dunk. But we are up by 12 now. Curry's got 19 points on 60% shooting. Okay, Curry. I see you. Larry Nance, come set the screen. You're going to roll right to the basket or not. Give it up to Harold, though, and he's going to throw it down. Would you look at that? Bringing us up back by 12. All right, there's about 15 seconds left in this second quarter. We dropped 76 points. Warriors also dropped 62, so there was not defense played for either side. Um, oh, that's an easy bucket for me. I'm just going to take it. Oh, my God. That's the dunk animation I'm talking about. I've already got 12 assists. Okay. Oh, I took a bad shot. I made that. I made that. And we end up dropping 80 points in this first half. Wow, that was actually sick. We're currently up by 19, and we are literally just going back and forth with um, shots. So, like, hurry, every possession scoring. We're usually scoring every possession. Like, look at it. We are literally, there's no defense being played this game. Warriors call a timeout. We're just going back and forth. Currently a 17-point game, and Steph Curry's got his takeover. If I was him, I'd just pull it from the logo. But James, what? Damn, okay, young fella. Oh, Curry, he, he's lost. He He's lost defensively. Like, he really can't guard me. Curry came back with the three, so you know what I'm going to do? Back and forth, Curry. Oh, okay, I'm going to miss is what I'm going to do. But Kevin Love on the boards. He gets fouled, and he was 100% smothered and very late on that shot. Curry's giving me... Oh, what was that delay? 2K. Drummond. Thank you, Kevin. I went to go shoot it, and the meter literally just didn't pop up until I unpressed... I can't speak. Until I unpressed square... And then it popped up, but it was already too late. And James Wiseman gets blocked. It's a 14-point game. The Warriors just aren't playing defense. Like, like, look at this defense from Wiggins. I'm going to shoot it. I'm going to miss. Oh, I made it. Like, they're not playing defense. That's their downfall. Like, if they're going to come back in this game, I just got to not try on defense and on offense. That's literally just it. Curry with the ball on Garland, though. He's been, do he's been scoring, like, every single play. Is he going to do it again? He, no, he doesn't, and I get my first rebound of the game. I swear to you, he's been scoring, like, every play. He's got to have, like, almost 30. Um, Okoro, he gets the bucket. All right, then. Now we're up back by 19. Oh, my God. That, oh, yeah, I somehow didn't get the steal. The ball hit me in the face. I thought that was going to be an easy steal. Oh, and, that, no, it just turned up to be easy points for Wiggins. Oh, I got my takeover, huh? Okay, screw it. That's not going in. I lied. Oh, on another fast break. I'm going to stop and pop. Bang! 25-point game, and I have 46 points, and we're not even in the fourth quarter yet. This was a close game. It got to around 14 points, but, like, the Warriors literally can't play defense. Steph Curry's tired. Klay Thompson, he's going to hit a three, and the drought ends for the Warriors. Still a 22-point game, though. All right, I'm getting subbed out. Both teams are going to score over 100 points in three quarters, and we're up by 24. There's no defense just being played. None at all. For both teams, to be honest, because the Warriors scored 100 in three quarters. We're at 127. So, yeah. 
apparently the slider situation didn't work or just the Warriors are that bad. Wiggins goes to the bucket. Like, they've been hitting pretty difficult shots, so... And they're actually making their open ones most of the time. So, I think if I just turn the sliders up a teensy bit, or if I face, like, a better team like the Lakers or Clippers, we'll see how that goes. And maybe it'll go better. I'm going to pull up. That's a bad shot. Yeah. The Warriors still have room to come back in this game. There's eight minutes left, and they're down by 20. So, with, with Steph Curry, Clay Thompson, they can definitely still come back. Why is Drummond playing power forward? Okay. Well, I'll just throw this down real quick, and that's 48. I'm definitely dropping 50. I might drop 20 assists. That was literally my stat line. 51 points and 20 assists in the game that got messed up against Nuggets. So, can I do it again? Yeah, I probably will. And this bucket right here is going to give me 51 points. The Warriors cut it to 19, and now it's just back to a 22-point game. I mean, once again, like, they're not playing good defense. They could have cut it to 17, but Kelly Oubre attempted a very dumb shot. Um, unless I get 20 assists, that most likely is going to be the last clip you see of this game because it, it's over. There, there's six minutes left. They're down by 19. So I doubt they come back. If they do, you'll see it. And this right here can be my... It's not my 20th assist. Jared Allen, get that back. We're going to do this again, all right? All right you're are literally alone in the paint. And now you're not. What is going on? Jared Allen, come set the in screen. Come set the screen. All right, I'm passing it, bro. Jared Allen ruined that play. He gets the rebound again, and he goes right back. Now you want to score? Now you want to score? Jared Allen, we're going to try this again, all right? I want 20 assists this game. So we're going to attempt to get that right now. I'd like you to get it. I'd like you to get There it is. There it is. 20 assists, Jared Allen. Yeah, this game's over. They were coming back, though. They pushed it to a 10-point game at one point. But once again, neither team can play defense because we've allowed 129 points. All right, with 13 seconds left, we are going to end up walking out of our home stadium with a huge win over the Warriors. I ended up dropping 55 points. We dropped 152 as a team. I'm going to take this last shot. I'm going to miss it. doesn't matter. 137-152. Both teams didn't play defense. So I have a feeling these sliders might be good just because the Warriors aren't that great of a team. Like, they don't have a good bench. So, as long as it wasn't a 30-point victory. At the end of the game, Gerald ends up dropping 55 points, 21 assists, 2 steals, and 2 blocks on amazing shooting. I mean, what else is... three? Only 3 times he went to the line. So, that's crazy. Larry Nance had a very good game. All I was doing was just pick and rolls to him. 22 points, 12 rebounds, and 5 assists. He also made a 3. He only missed one shot, which was probably a mid-range. Jared Allen, this is probably the future front court. This might be the front court next season if I do return to the Cavs. It's going to be a lot of fun. 18 and 7 for Allen. No blocks, though, which is weird. Um, Harold only had 17 points. Sexton only had 14, but they did it on good shooting. Drummond, 12, 10, and 4 blocks. Kevin Love off the punch play off the bench. Off the bench played well. Um, anyway, Steph Curry dropped 63. Didn't know that. I was just giving him basically free shots at the end, but, I mean, most of this he did on his own. Wiggins ended up dropping 24, and Clay only hit threes and only attempted nine shots. But 63 points from Steph Curry. Wow, that's going to be it for me. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new. GG.